Hey guys, it's Ren from Makeup by Ren Ren, and if you want to see this look, my purple and hot pink rock star eyes, stay tuned for more. Hey y'all, so I'm back with another makeup tutorial and giveaway, and this is the look I have going on. Um, I used the matte 88 palette from SedonaLace.com. They sent it over for me to test out and as well as give one away, which got to wait till the end of the video to see that part, but I wasn't sure what kind of look I wanted to do. I tried a bunch of different color combinations actually, and I ended up falling in love with the purples and the hot pinks. Hot pink is my favorite color in general, but I love the way the purples have like a violet undertone, so I kind of just came up with this look. Um, just using this palette, nothing else. And I really like the way it came out and it's, you know, another fun, bright look. Dramatic for those of you who have been requesting old school Makeup by Ren Ren looks. So, um, if you're into matte colors like me, the 88 matte palette is a better option than the regular 88 palette or even the shimmer palette just because it has more op matte options. But the cool thing is, is that even though they call it the matte palette, there are just a few shimmers in here. So that kind of gives you you know, a little bit of shimmer action, especially like these silvers up here, um, some of the blues and purples. So I really like the way that um, the colors are vibrant when you will use a base. Make sure to definitely always use base with these kind of palettes or else they won't stay and they'll blend out. So since it's a matte, they are harder to work with, but I think it's worth it because the color payoff is better in my opinion, just a personal preference. Um, and they photograph a lot better than shimmers, I noticed. So if you want to see how I use the, the 88 matte palette in this look, stay tuned for the tutorial. Okay, let's start. I already primed this eye using the Gemma Kid Pro Eye Perfector. It's a little double-ended base for your eye. And now I'm going to go to my 88 matte palette. And we're just using this for the shadows. So first I'm going to take a flat brush and get this purple shade down here. It's like a violet -y shade. And I'm going to pat it on to my entire lid. Okay, now I'm going to take a blender brush like this one from Modern Basic. And I'm going to get the hot pink color right here and I'm going to apply it above my crease. take another blending brush, this is the MAC 217, and I'm going to get this brown shade right here, kind of like MAC Soft Brown, and we're going to blend out the edges of that hot pink to make a smoother transition. And I'm going to take a small little brush like this from Modern Basic and get the white eyeshadow at the top left corner and apply that as my highlight. Now I'm going to take a pencil brush. This is from Stars Make a Haven, and I'm going to get this darker purple shade here and apply it on the inside and outside of my lid as kind of like a contour color. Then you're going to reapply the violet to the center of the lid to just kind of keep it highlighted and light. A little bit more hot pink above the crease. And 
and a little bit more brown, fading out the hot pink. Now on the lower lash line, you're going to take Milani Color Brilliance Pencil in purple and apply it to the incomplete lower lash line. Then you're going to take your pencil brush and get a little bit of the light violet that you put in the center of the lid and take on the inner half. And then you're going to take the dark purple you put on the inner and outer corners on the outer half. And then I'm just going to kind of clean up this edge right here with a Q-tip. And we're going to line the top lid with L'Oreal Carbon Black Liner, Liquid Liner. And now I'm going to apply my lashes. I'm wearing Ardell Wispies. And I'm also going to put a little bit of black liner, liner on my waterline, and I'll be right back. Okay, so the lashes are on. I use um, Urban Decay Zero Pencil on my waterline just to kind of deepen it out. A little bit of Jelly Pong Pong Mascara. And now I happen to get a little liquid liner my cheek but I might as well just leave it and pretend it's a beauty mark so I'm going to take a nude lip gloss because the eyes are super dramatic NYX's um, Frosted Beige, really like this one and apply it to my lips and as for the rest of the face just so you know what I'm wearing I actually airbrush, airbrush my foundation I'm wearing Temp2 um, silicone based foundation set with some Temp2 loose powder. Then I contoured with MAC Sculpt and Shape powders. This one and this pinkish one. Then for blush, I use the Gemma Kid Trailered Color Powder Blush Duo in Clear Pink and Rose. Eyebrows, I use Stilo Brow Pencil in Earth Brown along with Cork Eyeshadow from MAC. And I think that's it. So this is my final look. It's kind of like a rock star funky look using the matte 88 palette. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. And of course, you know how I love doing my giveaways. So um, if you want to get this palette, I got mine from SedonaLace.com. Um, you can also use the $4 off coupon, which is RenRen, and it does not ever expire if you want to get this at a discount. Um, and of course, um, like I said, I'm giving one away. J Jason from Sedona Lace is giving another one of these awesome palettes away to you guys. So all you have to do to enter is go to my blog, MakeupByRenRen.com, and follow the link in the description box, which will show you how to win. Just follow my blog, subscribe to my YouTube, and leave a comment telling me why you'd like to win. And then I'll announce it on my blog as well as Twitter. So good luck to all of you to win this 88 palette so again thanks for watching check out my blog and until next time have a great night ciao bellas